As the political atmosphere in Accra North and South keeps charging towards the federal constituency by election, the stakeholders across party boards have urged the electorate and the good people of both constituencies to be law abiding before, during, and after the election coming on Saturday, 26 February 2022. Speaking with Kaftan TV on the issue, the police public relations officer in the state, Fumi Odulami, said the police is fully set for the election. She emphasized that police will deal decisively with anyone or group of persons trying to foment trouble. The police is fully prepared for the day. Readily, we've deployed sizable numbers of men to ensure there is peace within the community, within the area, even before the election. During and after the election, it will still be the same. We've invited all contestants. We've told them to embrace the spirit of sportsmanship. And of course, we believe INEC will give them a level playing ground where everybody will go to the field and people will decide who they will. And this is also to overzealous fans and supporters. Please, election is not a do or die affair. Do everything within the ambit of the law. Go out on that day. Vote for whoever you think you want. Do not go there to cause trouble or ferment trouble with anyone. And we are using this medium to talk to parents and guardians too. Talk to your children and what. Election is not a do or die affair. Just go out. Do the right thing on your own part. Exercise your franchise. And if need be, go home. In his own response, a political party steward, Olaye Yaketide, said election should be done accordingly, saying electorate should vote for the candidate of their choice. My principal advice is to tell people to come out and mass and pick the candidate of their choice to be voted for. There is always a dividend in democracy if you come out to do the franchise, that is exercising your right as a voter. If you decide to stay at home and you say nothing will happen, you'll be electing wrong people to the, to, to the wrong position. So whatever we are saying now is just come orderly in Nigeria, there are security, nothing will happen on Saturday, everything will go on peacefully without any problem. Vote for the right person and let the right person uh, win the election. And you, not, you can now see demo, demo, um, dividends of democracy. So that's my advice. Vote bind, it should be completely ruled out of it. Also speaking with Kaftan TV, Honorable Yeinka Koshile said, Akure has learned from the past mistakes. Therefore, all lands should be on deck to have a peaceful and fair and credible election. I advise people to just come out and vote for their choice. Election today is already improved better than the one we are witnessed in the past. Unlike before, you see goat at the backyard of other protesters. But today, everybody, even though if they meet each other, they greet each other. So I know by God's grace, the forthcoming election, there is not going to be a problem. Also speaking, Taiwo Adigbe said people should vote according to their conscience and hold the youth to be law-abiding and remain calm. We should not sell our votes and they are youth should not fight. They should stay calm. I appeal to all the youth and old people that they should not fight. They leave the whole thing for God to decide. That is my advice for the youth and the, for the old people. Meanwhile, all effort to speak with Deji of Akure, Obalade Toi Balade Lucy proved abortive. From Akure to a meetup where I did a reporting for Kaftan TV News.